Good morning, folks. Welcome to Elven Acres Farm. Had a beautiful sunset last night, but boy, this morning we are getting rain. This is what the farm looks like. About two inches of rain dumped on it. Going down to take care of the chickens this morning. Every bit of road, flat spot, got lots of water standing on it. This area over here in the fields. Uh, it's usually dry, but it can catch water when it gets enough, and it's looking like a large pond right now for sure. The water barrel has been getting low, but it has got to be up to the top again today, I'm guessing. Yep, it's got a couple of holes in it, so that's why it only goes as high as it is there. Let's get inside the barn here and see how the ladies are doing. water flowing right into the barn here. Have to see about fixing that. It runs right back out again, so it's not so bad. Let's get them to treat this morning for their table scraps. I apologize, it's kind of definitely loud in here. Metal roof on the barn. Okay, so we got a lure them all over here. So I can actually get my down, hand down over here. If only my kids would fight over that that much. Right. While they're busy with that, we can go collect some eggs. five eggs. If we need a bit of water, shouldn't take too long to fill up a bucket of water here. And if we need to top off the food, so I'm going to go ahead and get those things taken care of here. off water someone's going to the top of the stack there and water's filled up this lady's still working on her egg someone else is in the holding pattern for the most popular egg box 
check back a little later. Hopefully when the rain dies down a bit. Alright, it might be a little crazy, but I'm gonna try and take a quick run down to the pond so we can see how that's looking today. Definitely guessing that we're using our overflow today. Rain has definitely died down, which is nice. Water coming off the field here a little bit. Coming down. And while it's usually just a little trickle, you can see the stream running through there now. Water coming down off the hill. My wife has to take the kids into town for some doctor's appointments this morning, so she'll be leaving early to just make sure there's no flooding to avoid or anything. Temporary stream going here today. Kind of birds we got around there. We got something big. Great blue heron on the far, far side. Probably definitely hard to see on the camera here. See where the muddy water is rushing in. Different colors going on here. And not too much overflow. The wind kicked up some of the scrap metal I've been pulling out of this pile over here. There's a little boat with a bunch of junk in it I've been sorting out. Fortunately, the wind the past few days kicked up some of that, but that was easy enough to get out of there. So, you know, a little bit of overflow here. Let's go away. This is terrible. Standpipe's right there somewhere. Tons of water. Plenty of water flowing out there from the sand pipe. And I'm running down the other end of the property. There goes some kind of bird. Maybe an eagle? No, that's the. Never mind, that's the creepy the hair and everything taken out of here. That's what lands in a tree. Mm -hmm. This is one of the last remaining sections of barbed wire that's still up here 
on the property, you know, inside the property line. I'm making progress on all this. Let's see if I can find myself a place where I can get around here. Even all the floats in here, you can tell that a bit of a gully washer getting all this stuff out of here. All the silt and dirt coming down out of the neighbor's property here. Middle of February, and we're here in spring peepers. Little baby frogs. Still plenty of chance for things to refreeze though, so we'll see how they do. This is one of the uh, fish bones that we found. That the, uh, we assume the eagle has been pulling stuff out. And these are the scales from the Asian carp. Uh, this one here is probably either a bass or a um, catfish, I'm guessing. The Asian carp are a bit bigger than that. Yeah, they really littered the place with the scales. Look over here at this other stream that's coming in from the neighbor's property. That is the jaw of a catfish that the eagle's got. The ants and the bugs on there. But I can put my whole fist in there if I want to, of course. Uh, that was a big catfish that they got. Got some monsters in that pond. So yeah, plenty of water coming down this way. Goes down this way and things out there. All right, rainy day here at Elven Acres Farm. Thank you very much for joining. And please come back again soon and watch some more. Take care now.